Hello everyone. Well, today is, I think it's day 25 of um, lockdown. And tonight I'm going to, I'm being drawn to take us on a higher consciousness journey to Alpha Centauri, actually. And uh, that has been popping in my head for the last hour or so. So we're going to go there. Um, I don't quite know what we're going to do there, but we'll just see what happens. So uh, I'm just going to put some lovely music on. I hope you're having a, a good day wherever you are on this beautiful planet. And I hope you're enjoying the videos that I'm putting up. Um, they're for everybody to share and to gain knowledge from. And I will say that each video you do, you are expanding your consciousness by following these videos. It goes beyond, it goes far beyond me just speaking. It's actually energetically very, very powerful because it goes beyond what we know to be this time and space. Uh, so everything that I'm putting out there has a huge amount of energy behind it. Um, and multidimensional um, energy, if you like, or vibration. And um, it's... It's very powerful stuff once you start going down this journey and you get more involved in this journey of healing. But it's more about knowing who you are and your own abilities. So we, we you know, it's taken me a long time to get to this point of knowing who I am. And even now, while I'm talking to you, I can see a lot more that's going on through many other dimensions in my consciousness. Uh, I can, I don't know whether everybody can do this, but it's like I can see into different places at one time, even though I'm speaking here. So, um, and that must be my multidimensional self kicking in. And that is how we are, multidimensional. So you don't have to just be in this time and space. And yes, I do live a normal life. I have things to do outside and inside the house and like everybody else. But there's so much more to us humans than what many believe there to be. And there's um, there is a few like me, uh, quite a few like me on the planet that are sussing out their own skills and who they really are. But, I, you know, even for us, there's more. So... Um, there's a lot to learn yet for all of us. So anyway, here we go. We're going to go to Alpha Centauri. I don't know why we're going there, but we're, I'm really being drawn to do a activation meditation to take us there and to see what, what unfolds while we're there. So enjoy. So I've just put some lovely music on, which we'll start in a minute. So I want you to get yourself into that nice space. And when I do these videos, I'll just explain. If I'm closing my eyes, it makes it easier for me to take us all there. And I feel you all with me as we go. And it doesn't matter, as I say with all my videos, when you do this, what time and space you do it in, doesn't matter. But we all are going together in our multidimensional selves. So... Let's get into that beautiful, beautiful space, feeling that unconditional love, breathing in unconditional love, breathing it right in really deep and breathing out, breathing in again, beautiful unconditional love, breathing in very deeply, allowing your tummy to expand and your chest. And out. Breathing in again. And breathing out. 
feeling that unconditional love coming in once more and going right the way through your body, out through your energy field and into your field, out through your skin and into your field. So you're now lying or sitting in a bubble of unconditional love. So I want you to just, just allow yourself to float. And go into that space of nothingness. That space that holds nothing, but also holds everything. I often see it like I'm in space and I'm floating through this darkness. I have no physical body, I'm pure energy. Floating through space now. Allowing yourself to go deeper and deeper into this relaxation. Feeling your body totally relaxed now. Allowing yourself to float away. Floating through that blackness. That space that holds everything but appears to be empty. It is pure nothingness, but it is all that is, all at the same time. Now going deeper into space, deeper into that blackness, going deeper and deeper and deeper. You can see the stars all around you in the distance. And you can see, as you look back, you can see that you're getting further and further away from Earth. And you're going up into the cosmos, floating and flying up high. Going deeper and deeper into relaxation. Getting to a point where you don't even feel your physical body. And we're all going together to Alpha Centauri. The nearest solar system to ours. So we're going out of our solar system now. You can see we're going flying past the planets, and going out of our solar system and into the next. You can see there are three suns in this solar system. that we're heading towards now and you can see that this planet has other planets around it and there is one planet that is shining out to us and we're going towards that now it's like we're being drawn into this planet. And as we look from a distance and we start to get closer and closer and closer. From a distance, this planet 
looks like there is no life. It looks very, almost like our moon looks. You can see that there are what looks like hills and rocks and valleys. But as we get closer, we start to feel an energy field. And this energy field is quite dense. And we are so powerful that we can travel through this because when we are in this state of pure consciousness, we can travel through anything we like. So we're gonna travel through this energy field now. And it almost feels like we're going through this dense space. And then all of a sudden we fly out the other side. So it's like a wall. And as we come out the other side, we can see this planet now has completely changed. You can see it's lush green and beautiful, beautiful skies. And you can see from a distance showing there's a beautiful waterfall and you can see cities just dotted about as you're looking down with all this beautiful greenery in between each city and as you look back again you can see that wall is like a thick shimmering moving energy and you can see through to what looks like a rocky image a bit like our moon and you realize that this beautiful planet has a hologram image around it, making it look like there is no life. But as you've come through that and you look down, you can see that this is habitable. You can see that there are cities in unusual structures like you've never seen before and you're going to go down further now towards one of the cities and you can see that at the top of a very tall structure that has a cylindrical shape coming out from it and all the way round, but a flat top. You're going to come down now into that building. And as you are now through, as you can see, you can travel through walls, through structures. And as you are through the wall now, you're in that round domed place and you can see it's like from inside, it looks like windows, but from outside it didn't look like that. And you can see for miles around. And as you go down each layer of this building, you can see that there are many different beings and it's like they're at work. They are going about their business. You can see that some are with their families and they're being shown around this place. And in this space, it's like they don't know that you're there looking and observing. So we're going down further now and each floor has many different beings and they're all going about their business. And as you come down to what looks like the ground level, 
you can see there is a huge doorway which you're going to walk or float and go outside. And this ground floor is quite busy with lots of different beings, all different shapes and sizes, all going about their daily business. And as you walk out or float out through this doorway, you can see that on the edge, as you look down this very long road, you can see that there is like a, again, it's like a force field around this city. And in front of this building, there is a beautiful, beautiful fountain. And this fountain has the most amazing colored water coming out of different chutes all the way around and a beautiful large one in the middle which is like rainbow colours coming out. And there are people walking underneath these colours and you can see that these people as they walk underneath this coloured water, it's not really like water, it is pure energy in this rainbow fountain. So we are going to experience this. So we're going to float forward now and into that fountain and allow those beautiful colours to penetrate our very being. Feeling that coming into your body now, making your body tingle and vibrate as it's coming in and filling your body with this beautiful energy, these beautiful colours, feeling that with inside your cells as that coloured frequency and energy like something you've never seen before is going into each cell and activating your DNA. Just staying in this space for a moment. And as you've allowed this beautiful energy to penetrate your very being, penetrate your light body, your consciousness, you can feel yourself becoming lighter and lighter and lighter. so light in fact it's like you are blending with everything around you with the planets with this beautiful colored energy and in this space you can see that there are three blue violet beings in energy form that are coming up to you they're floating up to you. They are also in a higher consciousness state and from a higher dimension. And as they take your energy, it's like they are linking arms with you and they're taking you on a journey now as you're flying up and going up and up and up around and along into the atmosphere of this planet but you're traveling at high speeds now and they are taking you over the greenery and as you look down you can see that there are creatures that you've never seen before and they take you down in um, between these unusual looking trees and down onto the ground and allow you to observe these many different creatures that are living in these beautiful forests. And you can see that the trunks and the leaves and the beings and the creatures are all of a high vibrant energy. being 
beings now stand around you and start to speak through the consciousness and through the ethers to you downloading light codes of information to you. Kishana tera yapayo ura naite, si kotore amare nene, shano tiura pea pa si nakete, si kotore apa anaela, ura naite nai, si kashana tea pura isanai tea. Ushua te asa, ura mare te anora ia, ura mai enari te. Si kashana torain, zana doe pe te, su kushana te aparanai. Sana ura pai, yera nai te ua ishna nai. You can feel this energy penetrating your soul. Your soul recognizes this. And as you connect deeply now within yourself to your soul, you realize that you are a star seed from this planet. And you know this planet to be called Zebula. It is filled with life. And you can feel that connection with your heart and soul to everything that you're witnessing here and now. You know that you've lived here before. You are a star seed from this planet. Many, many moons ago on, this, on a soul level, you have lived here, you have loved here, you have felt this energy before and you feel it again now. And these beautiful blue beings now step forward. One by one, they step into your own energy as you become one with who you have been before. A beautiful blue violet being from a higher dimension, a higher realm, from Alpha Centauri. You can feel this within your own body now. And you are able now at this point to take yourself up through the canopy of these trees, which are like strange to you, but also you know them. And you know, as you see with your consciousness into this planet, that the whole planet is alive with energy and each and everything on it is connected to that energy. And as you come up through the canopy, you now fly back very, very quickly now with your beautiful memory of your starseed self within you now. This beautiful memory of this planet, Zebuli, feel the connection and this connection will stay with you and that knowing of who you are from the planet Zebuli in Alpha Centauri you will never forget and in your dream state and your meditations you will be able to come back into this space and explore 
even visiting family members from this planet. The blue ray violet beings that you are part of. Now we're going to go straight up into the sky. We're going through that shield now because it's time to come back. You don't really want to come back. You want to explore more here. But you know that in your dream state or your consciousness when you do meditations, you will be able to bring yourself back to this space. When you come back next time, you will be able to come back as this powerful being that you are right now. You won't need to go into the waterfall unless you wish to do so. You will be able to travel around this planet and even go within this planet and communicate with the creatures on this planet. As we're now flying up into space, we're going to go through that energy field, that illusion, and go right the way through it now. And as you look back down, as you're going up at a high speed, you can see that that hologram of that rocky, desolate planet is now showing again. But you know that this is just an illusion. And that there is so much life and beautiful energy of a higher frequency that go is going on on this planet. But it is time for you to come back. So as you fly up into space towards our solar system, going extremely fast now, flying past planets very, very quickly, and coming into our solar system, you can see the Earth. And you're coming down now towards the Earth. And after a count of five, you're going to be back in your body. One, two, three. Feeling yourself now coming back into your body. Feeling your physicality wriggling your fingers and toes and feeling your skin back in your body four and five open your eyes wide awake wide awake back in the room welcome to this home you have many homes Zebuli, where we've just been, is one of them. You are a star seed, my friend. So I hope you've enjoyed today's star seed travel. And please share if you wish to. I will be here tomorrow doing a, another video. I'm not sure what, what I'm going to do yet. But I wish you lots of love. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe and click the little bell because you'll get notifications when I put videos up. And like I said, I'm doing this every day. And I'm doing this while we're in lockdown. So remember what I said before, that when you do this, we are all going there together. If you so wish, you can go on your own. That's fine. It's all safe. It's absolutely safe. It's a beautiful space. And your whole being has been activated while you were uh, on this journey. I'm sure you would have felt it in your cells like I did. I, f I could feel it. I could feel the energy, especially in that waterfall. Beautiful. So you can do this as many times as you like. And... I am going to say cheerio for now. So lots of love from me. Have a lovely evening or day wherever you are. Bye for now. Bye.